all that crying you do, you're not going to be in a major movie, babe. But in, you, in order for changes to be made down the line for other people to come, don't you have to voice your situation? You, she might not you see can't it. Voice she with might me. not see That's the just improvement. Like me coming in here she might not you. see the improvement, but her well, kids' kids might see the improvement. Not they ain't because see of her. Shit. Blacks don't do it. Ain't nobody gonna do it for us. So you can, I can complain all day about you, but if I don't break down the walls of white America, I'm just talking. So you sitting there, okay, now, since you said that you're not getting your worth, let's shut down every major movie studio it is until they pay blacks what whites is done. Why pick on Tyler Perry and Oprah Winfrey? Go to, go to Warner Brothers. Go to Paramount and tell them you ain't paying me and ain't nobody going to work here until I get a job and get white money. If you ain't going to do that, shut your motherfucking mouth. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. You, when you seen the Cat Williams interview, it went crazy. Monique was on there yesterday. Shannon Sharp. A lot of people get on here and say that it really, it 30, I think Lil Kiki said it was three weeks of just niggas talking about niggas. Man, yeah, but it pretty much they were upset about people. You gotta people. look at Monique, and you look at her, she's a crying, passing the buck for her in insecurities and her inadequacies. Ain't nobody blackballed her. She blackballed herself with a big ass mouth. Fat people always try to talk fat, then they want to get skinny and act like it, it, it's somebody else's damn fault. I, I, she's not even that damn funny. You understand me? She needed you. Uh, 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 don't do that. Don't <laughs> do that. Not, hold okay. on, hold on. Okay. I went and watched Monique live and in person, and she had me rolling. Don't she say she's not funny. Because you a girl, too. She ain't had me rolling on shit. I don't, I you don't went think. and watched her before. I've seen her when she started off, and, and her, her, her biggest jokes is fat women talking about skinny girls. Little skinny bitch, you need to do this and you need to do that. And, I, I, and next thing you know, she getting a breast reduction. She getting this. Lot. Well, I thought you was comfortable in your skin. Fat ass. Everybody fat want to be skinny. So she uh, eat a gang of them with me. I'm just saying. <laughs> so and she, she, she mad at Tyler Perry. But she, she not, mad she not as big as she used to be. She been working out. Yeah, well, well, why did she was happy when she was fat? So why you get skinny and Big get mother, uncomfortable? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Because as you get older, you want to be healthy. You have to be comfortable in the skin that you're in. You can't just be like, oh, I don't love myself. You have to do self-love and then you want to improve. See, a woman always defend another woman. I don't don't give a do damn. that. I give a damn about fat ass Monique and her fat body. Even if she, if she weigh 105, she's still a fat, uncomfortable lady that's bitter. She Which said Tyler energy. Berry and them didn't pay her uh, the money. She uh, wasn't worth it. <laughs> the fuck? What the hell? You just, because you did precious? Hey, girl, you ain't no hell of a person. You was a drug addict. You look better as a drug addict than any other picture you ever done. But she, she has her husband, and they say that he's the one that kind of, you know, he, he calls her, da she calls him daddy. Mm -hmm. And, and you know, she's very, you know, she tells the story about how people have tried to manipulate her. Tyler Perry being one, Oprah Winfrey being another. Um, well, how do you manipulate somebody you giving them a job? She said they didn't pay her what she, they know, baby. She said, baby, they didn't pay her her worth. What she, What's she that, worth? A hamburger? Ain't nobody worried about what she, how, look, look, one thing about, and the only defense I can come with black America, with Tyler Perry them and all of it's on your show, the shit that you're doing, you can't make the numbers that Vlad made. Because he's on a, so if I tried to charge you what I charge Vlad, Vlad can give me $10,000. If you ain't got but 300, I'm supposed to be mad at you? Black people have a, uh, you know, it's just like, Taraji Henderson talking about yeah. You know, Taraji said they did her wrong. How they do her wrong? You got a job after after power. What's the name of Empire? You ain't work no more. She did that when they came out with the with that sh the pur color, purple. color purple. It seemed like they, I don't know if that was a promo. I don't you know. know. It, it, and then you, and you, all these people do that. Even when when uh, what's the little girl bald head with the alopecia? Uh, 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 Jada Pig, like when she came out with her book, she it, all of a sudden all these stories come out. When when Monique first was talking about, uh, Monique was talking about they didn't pay her enough. Taraji didn't come out, but when she 
came with a project, she came out and said they did her wrong on the pay. Yeah. Um, everybody seems to come out when it's convenient. When it makes sense when for them. Yeah, but you cannot, the box offices that white America have, black America is not privy to. Color Purple didn't play in the movie theaters in California and Rolling Hills and Palos Verdes Peninsula where white folks were. Our screens are limited. Where it's 2,100, you may not get but seven. So it's a harder making money. So I can't pay. What are you worth? Who, who has that? I get, if, I remember one time we, when uh, uh, Cap, we, they went to Africa with Lennox Lewis and it was $10,000 to fly over there. And we got paid like $5,000 a week just for doing nothing. None of these dudes had ever been out of California. And then they worried about, I can't count your pockets. Whatever we agree to, we agree to it. So she agreed how much money she was gonna get when she did the movie. Just like you said, a contract was made. And when you made that contract, you said, okay, yeah. Now you trying to count Tyler Perry's pockets. You trying to count what Color Purple did. I, my worth, your worth ain't shit. So I mean, I have nothing against Taraji, but excuses are tools to build a monument of nothing. And you're not gonna get the same pay as Mae Britt or Sally Wing or whatever them white folks get. All that crying you do, you're not gonna be in a major movie, babe. But in, you, in order for changes to be made down the line for other people to come, don't you have to voice your situation? You, she might not you see the improvement. She with might me. not see That's the just improvement. Like me coming in here she might not you. see the improvement, but her well, kids' kids might see the improvement. Not they ain't gonna see of her. If blacks don't do it. Ain't nobody gonna do it for us. So you can, I can complain all day about you, but if I don't break down the walls of white America, I'm just talking. So you're sitting there, okay, now, since you said that you're not getting your worth, let's shut down every major movie studio it is until they pay blacks what whites has done. Why pick on Tyler Perry and Oprah Winfrey? Go to, go to Warner Brothers. Go to Paramount and tell them you ain't paying me and ain't nobody gonna work here until I get a job and get white money. If you ain't gonna do that, shut your motherfucking mouth. Period. So we can always talk about the problem, but the solution is us. We spent, they said last year, blacks in America spent $70 trillion not to get a dollar back. Do you know how many countries that their whole economic growth ain't $70 trillion? And we spent it, and every country come over here, you go right down here on First and Broadway, they got a gang of signs. Si little Saigon, little Armenia, little Bogandisha, but all them signs, you'll never see a little Negro land. So they said, ask not one, we, de we demand, we fight for everybody in the world. We go to another country and die. L look at, amazingly, when, uh, with this Hamas shit, three black kids got killed. You dig what I'm saying? Out of all white America, now they gonna play on the bootstraps of, of black America. These three black children got killed. 47 got hurt, but a drone came over and killed three black kids from, from Georgia. You know? So the indoctrination of propaganda with America is alive and well, and we bite at it every time. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.